Hi, I just wanted to document a problem I've been having with the time machine, and uh, I've been Googling and reading and unable to figure out why this doesn't work, so I thought I would document this really quickly. So here we go. Um, I've got time machine running on my uh, 2012 MacBook Pro, and uh, you can see the oldest backup is August 10th, 2015, the latest backup is today. Uh, in terms of disks, there's my Time Machine disk. Uh, it's a partition on my Thunderbolt connected Drobo. Um, you can see both of them here, the, the Drobo and then the Time Machine partition on the Drobo. Um, and uh, and just make sure, check other options. So the Drobo and the Time Machine itself are excluded from doing backups. Um, and yeah, that's the, that's the settings on this machine. Uh, just for the full picture, so the Drobo Thunderbolt connected time machine is a partition on the Drobo, also Thunderbolt connected, of course. Uh, SSD is the system disk, which is a physical SSD, and users is a uh, traditional spinning uh, laptop hard drive, which has replaced the optical drive uh, in this laptop. Um, so if we take a look uh, inside the time machine, um, partition. We can see indeed the oldest backup here is 2015, 2015 August 10, uh, which matches what we see here. Um, and the newest backup is uh, today, okay, which is May 8th. And you can see that's today here. Um, and all the files are in there and, and everything. So you see there's our two disks, the SSD and the user's uh, disk slash partitions. So everything looks fine, right? Um, problem is when we go and, and enter Time Machine, um, we've got, sure enough, okay, there's August 2015 up here. Um, that's where it is, right? Um, as, as expected, and there's today, great. Well, I can't actually access these backups. I don't know why, but I mean they show here, but I can't access them. If I try and go back in time, you see the backups we're looking at here are all mobile backups. These are backups that are stored on the uh, internal hard drives of the laptop um, for making backups, snapshots hourly throughout the day uh, when I'm not necessarily at home docked, plugged into the external backup drive. Um, so that makes sense that the most recent ones might be mobile backups. Um, if we scroll backwards, what's going to happen? So now we're into yesterday. Is that I can't go back. See, this is grayed out now. Uh, yesterday at 7.15, this is as far back as I can go in time. That's right there, right? So I can't go back any farther. Um, well that's kind of annoying um, because that's not very useful to me so um, other things I've tried uh, hitting the alt key while I'm here and and making sure that I'm really talking about this this two terabyte um, uh, backup uh, over here um, but it's the same thing so if I go back this is mobile backups if I try and go back farther I cannot. Um, don't know why that is. <laughs> so I've had to resort to basically, if I have a file restoration I have to do, which does happen, I have to just come here manually, go find the file and restore it myself manually, as opposed to using the the enter time machine functionality, which just doesn't, doesn't work for me for whatever reason. I don't know if it's that my mobile backups are screwed up. I mean, Time Machine clearly sees the backups here. Um, and uh, yeah, so I don't I don't know how to fix this. I've been, been doing Googling and all sorts of other fun stuff, no luck. Um, one other note, I did uh, reboot the machine into recovery mode, opened up the disk utility, and ran disk uh, verification repair, permission verification repair on all of these uh, all of these different partitions just to be safe because I heard this could potentially cause an issue. Um, but 
yeah, I mean, at the end, it obviously didn't make any difference, and there weren't really any problems either when I did that. So, um, see, we've even got a backup going right now. It's not great. Um, I don't know if that's a mobile backup. No, nope. see, that's actually happening here on this Time Machine Partition Backup Disk. Um, yet I can't access these backups from Enter Time Machine. Anyway, pretty useless, pretty annoying. It would be great if uh, somebody could point me in the right direction of what I'm doing wrong. Thanks.